But Isaiah, I'm going to give you a chance to start this one off. Well, my AFC South prediction looks absolutely <laughs> rubbish. I might as well just throw it away right now and burn Good. it in the trash can. Um, <laughs> you know, like you said, Ace, I'm not going to overreact to Houston. It was one game. They're playing Trevor Lawrence. Uh, the offensive line for the Jags suck. The defensive line is atrocious. Um, you know, I don't know why Urban Meyer didn't run the football with James Robinson even more uh, than he did. But, you know, I don't. I mean, I don't think he was calling the plays. It was, yeah, it was Dar Daryl Bevel, the offensive coordinator, and Brian Schoenheimer, who both came from Seattle. So they are used to run heavy offense. I don't know why they didn't run the football more. But, you know, Ace, Chris, Laurel, John, I think it's panic time in Jacksonville. And the reason why I say this is because oh, – yeah. Hold on. The reason why I say this is because of this. Yeah, the Jaguars lost. They got manhandled. We saw that. It was an ugly performance. But if you looked at the reports that came out before the game, there's reports from Jason Lock and Four, and this came from two two prominent NFL reporters, Jay Glazer of Fox and Jason Lock and Four of CBS. They reported that Urban Meyer is wearing people the wrong way. Uh, he is having a short temper. He's yelling at coaches. Um, he is, you know having a short temper with players. Yeah. Uh, he is just not have. It's not good right now in Jacksonville. And even Jay Glazer, I believe, went as far as to say that it was a toxic situation right now in Jacksonville. And knowing Urban Meyer's history uh, with him not being used to losing in college and, you know, quitting because, you know, health issues and stuff like that. If the situation – because I know, like, I think – on the Jacksonville Jaguars schedule, this was probably the game that I thought uh, was the easiest on their schedule just because of how bad Houston was. If you look at the Jaguars schedule to the rest of the way, I mean, they got John's Denver Broncos. That Denver Bronco defensive line is going to eat up that offensive line for the Jaguars. And Trevor Lawrence, I think, is going to get sacked like five to six times. Then they got the Cardinals. But the way the Cardinals play, I think the Cardinals can blow them out. Then they got the Titans, the Dolphins, the Seahawks. Hawks, the Bills, the Colts, um, the 49ers. Where are they going to get a win there? I don't really see any team that is going to – they're, they're going to defeat with how they look on Sunday. The Falcons, they might beat them. Uh, and then the Rams, you got the Titans, the Texans again, the Jets, Patriots, Colts to end the season. With, with how – Strenuous the situation is right now in Jacksonville and coaches not liking Urban Meyer, players not liking him. I think with the losing, you combine the losing with that situation that's going on, I think Urban Meyer could lose the locker room halfway into the season. And I would not be shocked if Urban Meyer is out as Jaguars head coach after the season. 